Little Oink, Amy Krauss Rosenthal, and Jen Corace. And now comes the story of Little Oink. Little Oink was a neat little pig. He liked a lot of things. He dug playing with his pig pals. Hey guys, I found a truffle. He savored his days at school. And he relished nighttime with Mama Pig and Papa Pig. This little piggy went to market. This little piggy stayed home. This little piggy had roast beef. This little piggy had none. And this little piggy ran all the way home. But there was one thing Little Oink did not like. Mess up time. Because that's what you have to do when you're a pig. Make a mess, mess, mess. All of my friends get to clean their rooms. Why can't I? asked Little Oink. If you want to grow up to be a respectable pig, you must learn how to make a proper mess, said Papa Pig. Mess up your room, put on some dirty clothes, and then you can go out and play, said Mama Pig. Do I have to? Little Oink snorted. Yes, you have to, they retorted. So off he went. When I grow up, I'm going to let my kids clean up their rooms as much as they want. He unmade his bed. He unfolded his clothes. He threw his towel on the floor. He put on a stained t-shirt. He dragged in some mud. Have I messed up enough? asked Little Oink. I still see toys in their bin, mister. Please, not another word until this room's a total pigsty. Fine, whined the swine. One toy, two toys, three toys, four toys, five toys, six toys, seven toys, eight toys, nine toys, ten toys. There, now can I go play? Yes, little piglet, now you can go play. And little Oink ran off to play his most favorite game. House. Sweep, scour, scrub. Now this is hog heaven. And they all lived happily ever after. When I grow up, I'm going to let my kids clean up their rooms as much as they want.